what's up guys and welcome back to everything gaming and on today's video i'm going to be helping you guys complete all four of the new upcoming forzathon event challenges uh, in which you can win the subaru brz horizon edition uh, which is a very very sought after car uh, i know a lot of people have been wanting to get it so let's get stuck in here uh, the first challenge is called take the lead and it wants you to perform 15 pass skills to earn 55,000 credits so a fairly easy one a second one called Queen of the Track wants you to win a championship in a European sports car to win three wheel spins. Uh, the third one is called Practical Applications and it wants you to complete a race to earn 35,000 XP. And the final one here called no Like No One Else wants you to perform 10 Daredevil skills to earn the Subaru BRZ Horizon Edition. So all three uh, of the first challenges can actually be done at the same time. So basically what you want to do is pretty much enter a, a championship uh, so you can get the 15 pass skills done over the course of three races. Now you will want to win the championship to win the second challenge and the third one just wants you to complete a race in which you can basically do in the first race of the championship. So let me show you how you can do all three challenges at once for the first challenge. Uh, first of all you're going to want to pick a car, a uh, European sports car. Now you can uh, basically filter them all in your garage, you don't have to do it in the garage, you can do it in the actual race. Uh, so you'll sort of have quite a lot to choose from, you know some Porsches if you have the Porsche expansion packs. Uh, Lotuses are always a good one but I went for my Audi TT. Now you want to pick a starting race so I've obviously always picked the highway circuit here as it's one of the quickest and easiest races but before we do that what you want to do is double check over in your skill shop tab that you do not have the pool rank perk now the reason is this will start you at the front of the grid in every race if you have this unlocked uh, for the first four races or whatever but you don't want to do that because obviously you want to get the passing skills so you want to start near the back of the pack as you normally would um, so that's just a little tip there as well as that obviously you're going to set up your tournament three races is all you need uh, that's the shortest you can have a tournament as well obviously create that blueprint now what i will show you next as well is where you'll obviously start in the starting grid so normally you've got about seven other cars in front of you so to speak so over two races obviously you hopefully would have overtaken 14 cars and on the third race you would have overtaken your 15th so you'll complete the pass challenge there uh, by the beginning of the third championship race uh, providing obviously you're always in a european sports car as well is the only way this will work and the other thing is you want to actually win the championship in order to complete the second challenge so i'm just showing you a little bit here obviously you all know what a pass skill is you can only do it in a race bear that in mind you can't do it when you're in free roam so you must be in a race uh, i'm just going to speed the footage up here because it might be a little bit boring for some of you but yeah in the first race you should have got about seven maybe eight overtakes depending on if a car behind sort of went in front um but it doesn't matter obviously if you overtake them or you don't have to slow down to let them overtake and then overtake again because it's just a waste of time uh, so just overtake them all from the beginning and then you will have basically seven pass skills completed at the beginning now when you finish the first race that will be the third challenge complete which just wanted you to complete a race then at the beginning like i said of the third race which is what i'm showing you here i skipped out the second one uh, after taking a, a couple more cars you would have completed the third falls upon challenge there uh, and then providing you've come basically in first place across all three of the races in the championship you will complete the second challenge at the end of the championship which wants you to win it in a european sports car so within the space of just one championship you would have completed the first three Forzathon challenges which is very very easy and like i said over just three races you would have completed three Forzathon events as long as you've obviously come first um anyway the last challenge here wants you to get 10 daredevil skills to earn the subaru brz horizon edition now a daredevil skill is three uh sort of near misses in very quick succession so I recommend coming over here in Surface Paradise. You can do it on the freeway, but there is a high congestion of tra traffic uh, down this sort of main high street, if you will, down by Surface Paradise. So like I said, all you need to do is get three near miss skills in a in quick succession or in a row really to get the Daredevil skill. And you need to get that 10 times to unlock the Subaru BRZ Horizon Edition. It is very, very easy. It doesn't matter what car you're in. You know, it doesn't matter how fast you're going. So as you can see there, I was only doing about 100 mile an hour past some of those cars, if not a bit slower as long as you get that near miss skill like i said three times in a row uh, and this is why it's easiest to get it done down here because of the congestion the amount of traffic there is there is a high higher density of traffic down this road majority of the time it is very very easy it will only take you a couple of minutes to get 10 of the daredevil skills uh, like i said you don't have to be doing 200 mile an hour through it all you can be sort of slowing down a bit doing it at your own pace uh, but it's entirely down to yourself like i said this is the easiest area to do it if you want to do it on the motorway feel free it might work there for you as well it might just not happen as quickly as it would down this road 
anyway guys uh, i hope this helped you out uh, i hope that obviously all of you unlock the subaru blz horizon edition it's a very sought out sought after horizon edition car um, and i hope that you've most of all enjoyed this video and that it has helped you out if it has don't forget to drop a like and subscribe for more videos just like this it's a massive help anyway until next time all the best and take care guys